What's up guys, it's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Liquid Crystal walkthrough. Okay, so, god damn, man, it's, it's, it's been a long adventure, long, long adventure, and I think we're at the tail end of this whole thing, because I may or may not have gotten the, the, uh, whatchamacallit, the, the, the Pokemon Liquid Crystal version that has probably only one gym, gym battle, so... This may or may not be the last episode. I don't know when we're gonna finish. There might be a few things that we still need to take care of. I don't even know, guys. But let's just treat it like our last. Let's be happy about this. I know I kind of sound tired. Trust me, guys. As I am recording this at uh, well, what was it? May 30th. Yeah, it's been a uh, whirlwind of events that's gone in my private life and you know personal. Oh yeah, my personal life and all that crud. And yeah, I'm sounding a little tired, but I'm willing and able to finish this whole thing up. So, first thing is first, I am assuming that we have to go to Professor Oak, because we do have the GS ball, and as you guys probably already know, yeah, the GS ball in the anime has never actually been, you know, it has never been figured out or anything. It's just been an ultimate cliffhanger right there. So, what we're gonna do now is we're gonna go straight back and, the hell? Hmm, he's late. Where are the others? Ah, there you are. Oh, the Mr. R and Mr. G. Good to see you again, R. You too. CNH? I think he's coming now. Oh, damn. Hello, friends. Still moody as always. Right, do either of you know where we're meeting? Uh, me, Mr. G H N R. Oh, damn. So, you're Zane, or you're Zane, are you? Heard you got locked away for murder. You heard wrong. Now, I hear you gentlemen are the people to go to for knowing people. Yes, the correct, that, that is correct. We've built up many contracts. Doesn't come cheap, though. I understand completely, and we'll pay you at the amount that you wish if you work for me. Doing what? We don't do murder or anything which can be proven to be a crime. Zane's like, you just helped me get to you to know people, and I need a set to handle things. So, do we have a deal? Damn. They're all thinking, what the hell? All right, then. Excellent. You won't regret it. Uh, oh wow so that was uh, kind of odd okay so that was odd right there and he did not go to he did not go away from murder and yes we're gonna be going back to Kanto and okay so the hell's been going on I'm just like I'm, I'm just as confused as always guys I really am this game has just been dramatic, as, to say the least. I'm just like, XC. Alright, so we're going to be going back to Kanto right here, speeding this up. And, let's see, hold on, hold on. We're in the mother-loving... Okay, so there we are. So here we are in Route 100, and now what we have to do is we have to go straight back to... Yeah, we have to go straight back to or to Kanto. Well, we are kind of in Kanto, but we have to go to Pallet Town and we have to talk to Professor Oak right here. So, let's see. Going straight to Pallet Town. Straight forward. And, well, here we are in Pallet Town. And now we're just going to be going here and going straight to Professor Oak. Ah, you've returned. I see you brought the GS ball with you. Well done, Draven. I knew you could do it. Let me take it from you. And this is most interesting. I have seen one of these before. I was about three years ago now. I wasn't able to figure anything out, but as soon as I... Or as soon as I got word that Professor Oak obtained another, yet another GS ball, I thought I would, would have had another crack at it. Thanks again, Draven, for bringing this... Uh, I'll need some time to work. Hey, I know. While I'm working on this, why don't you enter the Orange League? It is similar to the Johto and Kanto League, but it consists of only four gyms and a champion. I think you would be do really well in uh, the Orange League, Draven. Okay, so... 
I guess we're going back to the Orange Islands League. I think so. Holy crud. Holy crud. And... Yeah. Still looking for red, so... I guess we're going to be going back to the Orange Islands. I guess. And... Well, speed it back over there. Alright, so we're going to be speeding this whole thing through because... We did defeat a trainer in the last episode to... To get access to the gym. Okay, so that's the wrong one, and here we are. It's not the place, and here we are. Back in Valez uh, Valencia Island. And, well, all we need to do now is... I gotta fly. So I gotta fly straight to Meadow Town now. Now that we have access to that place. So here we are in Meadow Town. I have yet to... Let's see the town. Okay, so I have yet to visit any of the stuff, so we're gonna take a look at it. And this guy's like, don't you love the feeling of a nice smooth balls in your hand? What the hell? Pokeballs, that is. Wow, that was uh, about to be inappropriate. And, well, there's uh, one guy right here. And let's see, I'm from Hoenn. There was this uh, trainer who beat the league there called Brendan. What? You beat him in Johto? I'm envious of you. And there we go, we got ourselves a rare candy. Alright, so that's one. Now, in our last episode two, this area right here was closed, but now, since I guess the events, since we're re we returned the GS ball, I guess we can actually go in there or something. And let's see, the Orange Islands are gorgeous, aren't they? Yes, they are, I think. I don't know. I really don't know. And let's see, talk to this guy, so peaceful, that's why I came here to the first place. Okay, that's cool. And, well, there really isn't anything to do right here. And I guess we're gonna have to go take on the Pokemon Gym Leader. So, let's see, there's nobody else that believes in us. Meadow Town, Pokemon Gym. And, yeah, he came from Hoenn. So, let's go ahead and battle people right now. Alright, so let's go, Dragon Claw. Poison. And let's go again, Dragon Claw right there. And he's gonna be coming out with the lantern. So let's go, not that guy. Truly. Double the damage. And, well, here comes the charge attack. Now, I think in other iterations, charge actually, uh, what was it? Charge actually raises up your special defense. So that's, I guess that's pretty, that's what it does. Correct me if I'm wrong right there. And yes, we're gonna get hit quite a few times, but no. Biggie. We're gonna be using, uh, god dang it, Giga Drains. Uh, Sky Up Cuts right here, and look at that, Politoed defeated, and we defeated Greece right here. What kind of a name is that? Oh, it's a nice region, you should visit sometime. I did, I, you know, I beat the gems. I'm the champion. Oh, crud! Okay, so, oh wow, okay. So I guess I'm, a, I guess I'm understanding what's going on right here. Alright, so let's see, let's go straight up uphill right here, and well, let's go ahead and take on her right here, and she's like, so you're the Johto champ, you don't look so tough, you don't say, so let's go, she's coming out with Porcela, and she's coming out with the rock blast right here, so here we go again, waterfall, very physical, and she's gonna come out with the Ludicolo, so let's go with Latios right here. And go with the Fly Attack, and that nearly takes it out. Yeah, they have some pretty defensive Pokemon right there. And she's gonna be coming out with the Rim Rate, so let's go with Sparky. There we go. And she's gonna be coming out with an Octillery, so let's go straight to Thunderbolt again. And Omastar, of course, is a... Uh, Still that Pokemon right there that likes to screw around with electric types. And look at that. Safe and sound, okay. Uh what's the turn? Okay, non-stop. It's intense and Okay, so I see what's going on right here. Yeah, I see what's going on right here. Okay, so battle this guy. And of course they're gonna be coming out with all water type Pokemon. Maybe making the mistake because Lantern is also an electric type Pokemon right here too. So there we go. And bam, coming out with a Sharpedo, so let's go with Shroomly. Both a dark and water type Pokemon, and bam. Whale Lord. Wow, a big ass Pokemon right here. 
very, very powerful, very beefy, and Skyrim Cut does the thing, and there we go. He's like, screw this. <laughs> okay, and I think I'll train my Pokemon a little bit more in other regions. That's good for you, homeboy. That's good for you. You do you. And here we have, are you kidding me? You can't beat Sissy for, or me? Oh, that doesn't matter. Okay, whatever. Alright, so here we go, going up against Lauren, and she will be coming out with a clamp here. Now these are now these are Pokemon that you won't normally see in, in regular games. They're using just about every single little Pokemon right here, which is good. I'm actually happy about that. And here we go, Waterfall, come on. Here we go, Waterfall does its thing. Wall Rain is coming out, so let's go with Sparky, the Spark Dog. And Thunder Attack right here. Big ol' beefy Pokemon deserves a big ol' beefy attack, and yes, it's always. Okay, so let's see, going up here. And there is Sissy. So this is gonna be my first official uh, gym battle. You know, against an Orange Island's gym leader, so wish me the best of luck right here. So let's see, who are you? Draven from Johto? Nice to meet you. We don't get many challenges from Johto. I take it that you are here to challenge me to a battle. I accept your challenge. Ready, Draven? And here it is. Gym battle number one against Sissy, the gym leader of the Valencia City Gym, or Valencia Island. And right off the bat, she comes out with a beefy, beefy Pokemon. And, well, there it goes with its hail attack. So I gotta switch out Pokemon right here. So with Sparky, and of course it's gonna be, yeah, it's gonna try and uh, heal itself and all that stuff. So here we go again. And they like to use hyper potions. And look at that. Wall Rain had no chance, and she'll be coming out with a Gyarados right here. And you gotta love those hail attack moves. And there we go. Thunder attack takes care of Gyarados. I'm gonna stay, stay put right here with Riot, Riot you. And wow. Okay, so it's going to be coming out with Swampert right now. So let's go with Shroomly. And, well, it's going to protect itself. And, Crud! Well, it did it, it did its thing with Sky Epica, And, well, she's going to be coming out with a, Sh a Kingdra. So I got the Pokemon for that one. Let's go with Avalanche. Blizzard attack. And, come on! God damn it! God dang it, come on! God, man, that freaking annoys me. And there's another Hyper Beam, so... Let's go with Godzilla, and let's go with Slash Attack for the win. And she's going to be coming out with a Whale Lord. So now, this one right here is going to be a little toughy because, you know, Whale Lord's a big old beefy Pokemon, so it it is made for this kind of stuff. And hopefully Thunder, well, Thunder Mist, but there's a Thunder Attack takes care of that and BAM! That's how you do it guys. Our first gym badge in the islands. Orange Islands. Well you certainly are tough. You must have trained hard. You deserve this badge. Don't know what badge we get from her but it should be nice. And look at that. We get ourselves the Platinum Badge. Look at that. That's an official Orange Islands uh, League gym badge. There's a total of four badges to collect Throughout the islands, the Platinum Badge helps you gain stronger relationships with your Pokemon. I know you'll go f uh, far in the Orange Island League. Thank or good luck. Okay, so that was that. So let's well, let's go right ahead and you know go through the easy way right here. Okay, so that is a very very good victory right there for for us, and the police is still there. Uh, restricted assets, you can't pass. Oh, you beat CC with the gym leader? Go ahead and and beat these bad men. Okay, so now we can't go there. Okay, so I thought that was a, you know, a cliffhanger right there. I don't even know. Well, I guess that is pretty much it for this episode, guys. I kind of wanted to show you guys that. And do we get anything? Any graphics for... No, not really. Okay, so... Yeah, that is pretty much it for this episode, guys. Thank you guys for watching. In the next episode, let, we're, we're going to find out what's going to go on right here. 
Again, we're treating every single episode like if it was our last, because again, like I said, I don't know if I got uh, the Pokemon Liquid Crystal game that you know hasn't been updated in quite some while. In quite some while, because mind you, I did get this back in 2016, 17. So yeah, really don't know. So thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys.